Hey, welcome back, beautiful collective. Thanks, guys, for joining me here. Let's get pull you some tokens. These are 22 major arcana collective energy. I want to see what comes out for you. Collective energy, please, and thank you, spirit. There you go. Okay, what do we got here? A chariot. Oh, shit. The Empress. Oh, boy. The Death. The Hangman. And the strength. Okay. That's the infinity symbol, right? Look, I'm telling you that someone is not liking your power. They are not liking your strength here one bit. Somebody is like trying to delay, trying to stall you, and in some cases, end you. They want to see you have endings. They want to see you stuck. They didn't want you to awaken. You closed off your emotions to this person and you walked away from them. And they are jealous. You got haters. You have sneaky ass sneaks. And you have a lot of people who are regretting. They don't like your work. It makes people feel insecure to see you so confident they tried to cause you a tower for an empress and instead you're getting a victory and they hate it they tried to stop you they tried to block you they didn't want to see you getting any kind of victory any kind of good news and they wanted to judge you fight you Cause you drama. Tried to steal your power from you. Holy frick, man. <laughs> the devil. You broke free of the devil. And they are hurt. It pains them to see you get a victory. It pains them to see you so strong. It pains them to see you doing you, fulfilling your purpose, being protected. You had many people try to see you cause you a downfall. But here you are, blessed. And this depresses people, man. This pisses people off. It makes them worry. It stresses them the hell out to see you get a victory. They hate it. Hang on, collective. They actually hate the fact that you are getting a victory. They are wishing ill on you, wishing you towers, wishing you failure. Wishing you depression, 
wishing you stress, wishing you pain. <laughs> Jealousy. I told you, first card out. Jealous, hating on you or your relationships. Tried to block your sacral chakra. Which is your abundance, your connections, your creativity, your desire, your fertility, your freedom, your motivation, your passion, your pleasure, and your sexuality. Trying to cause you, like, um, issues with your house, leaky roofs, cracked walls, heat and cold systems, electrical wiring, plumbing, pipes bursting, broken windows, squeaky stairs, dark entities. Oh, God. Trying to dig dirt up on you. Turning others against you. Holy jeez. Collective. Who are these people, spirit? Who are these people? <laughs> Could be another lover. <laughs> Or this person's other lover, the karmic. Could be your own person. They want to see all your relationships. They there you could be using magic. It's because you were they're happiness haters. Hate seeing you happy. Period. Trying to keep you from trying to turn other potential suitors against you as well. Bring you burdens to your family, to your home, to your finances, to your career. Hateful. Could be a group of peoples. Trying to put instill fear in you, man. And you took the sword and you broke free. You are the empress. Your truth, your authentic look, you are protected by the universe with the Eights of Swords. The universe is cutting your enemies down and ensuring you a victory. You freed yourself. You freed yourself. You may have had to do a cord cutting ritual. You may have found it incredibly, incredibly hard breaking you free from this person. You might have found it almost near impossible. You had to muster up so much strength, you probably prayed to the universe to help you to get out of this relationship. You might have found it almost near impossible making the decision to free yourself. Because that was a strong tie. They wanted you rejected and broke in poverty, begging. That's where they wanted you. Because you're a star seed or a star, a healer. You've had people out to destroy you probably your whole life. King of Wands. Hmm. 
They wanted you stuck. They did not want you to free yourself. They did not want you having any kind of confidence, trying to make fun of you, trying to compare themselves to you, wanting you stuck with nothing and nobody. turning other people against you. You're all over there by yourself. Look in the opposite direction. Some of them they're angry. They're pissed off that you ended something with someone. They're pissed off. They're pissed off. The universe is offering you all these gifts. They may have wished you dead. Just saying. Wished that every relationship you had, that every love you found would end, it would end. You closed off your emotions to this person. They tried to hurt you. An earth angel. Slow you down. Destroy you. See you destitute. See you begging. This person wanted you to be a beggar. Selfish, self-gain, arrogant. Complete denial. Nobody hurts the emperor. Nobody. Nobody makes a fool of the emperor. I'm going to make sure no one trusts this em this feminine. I'm going to make sure no one trusts them. They're not done. They tried to control you. They forgot about this. <laughs> Karma. Trying to control destiny, people's destinies. Trying to control their relationships. Trying to control who's who. This person is getting awful haughty on themselves. I gotta tell you. They're awful big on themselves. Awful haughty. Arrogant. Prideful. This person tried to do shit to your car. This person tried to sabotage your car. They did.
they did something they did something tried to do something to your vehicle something with the fluids in your vehicle I would check your brake brake fluid or added something did this person try to sabotage your vehicle sugar in the gas tank adding things uh, cutting your brakes I don't know what they did adding fluids to places on your vehicle where they shouldn't be adding fluids to what the hell they tried everything Trying to find dirt on you. They can't stand to see you shine. Can't stand it. They were trying to put you in a state of paranoia. A state of fear. to wish bad luck on you. Well, guess what? You're still here. You're still here. It's being returned to sender. If you did a return to sender, that's exactly what they could be going through. They could be haunted by those demons they tried to send your way. Not knowing who you were. How protected you were. No, I'm really angry about this. And guys, I want to say, and I'm being told to say, it doesn't even have to be your past person. How many people from your past? And go over that list. It's looking like you could have had more than one hater. Anybody who is of the light has more than a hater. But you'll know who it is. They could be getting... trying to dig dirt up on you to use against you later. This person wanted you at their mercy. They wanted to know all of your business, all of your information, looking like they're being caring, looking like they're, they're um, very interested in your life and everything about you. It was so that they had dirt on you for later when it was convenient for them to pull it out of their arse. This person's really getting on my nerves, whoever they are. 
guys, you do not have to worry. You are the ace of uh, swords. You are protected by the universe. This is the universe doing this. The universe has the sword. We'll cut these people down. If you asked your angels to do a cord cutting ritual, and I wouldn't just say on this past person, I would say on anybody who is wishing you ill intent, please sever those connections and, and cut the cords. Nasty, nasty, cannot stand to see you shine. Take care.